I could not find any good tutorials for assembly language on YouTube. So I did some research and I made a tutorial myself. So in this tutorial we are going to learn how to write hello world in assembly language. Currently I am in Ubuntu 20 and you will need to know some basics of Linux to fully understand this tutorial. But I will try to be as elaborate as possible so that you guys don't face any problem while doing this. So in order for Linux or any Ubuntu system to understand assembly language, we need to install a compiler for assembly language. The compiler we will use for this tutorial is NASM and to install it, so you go to Windows, then you search terminal and you press enter. We have our terminal and the code we need to write to install our NASM compiler is sudo apt install and then NASM. So sudo means you have the administrator rights to this system and apt install means we are going to install a new software and that software is NASM. Now Ubuntu is asking me for the sudo password which is my administrative password. I am going to enter my password. Now keep note that I have already entered my password but in Linux systems the terminal will not show you any password that you have entered. But now if I press enter you can see the last line which is 0 upgraded, 0 newly installed, 0 to remove and 0 not upgraded. This line is showing because I have already installed NASM on my computer. Since we have NASM installed now we can finally write our assembly code. Now I will be writing all my assembly files in my desktop folder which means I will need to go to my desktop folders by writing cd then desktop. Now we are in desktop and I will create a file by saying nano and the file name will be first.asm. So in this line we are saying nano, nano means a uh, text editor just like notepad in our windows we have text editors like nano and vim in our linux. So currently I am using nano because it is very easy to use and we are saying that we need to create a file called first.asm. Now .asm is the file extension for assembly language. Now as soon as we press enter we enter the new file which is first.asm. Now here I will first write the whole code for hello world and then I will explain what I have written. So this is the basic code for a hello world program in assembly language. I will link this code in the description so you can copy and paste it. Now as soon as I press Control S we can see that our first.asm file is created on our desktop. Now what we need to do is exit this. We are in first.asm file and we need to exit this first.asm file for that we will press Control X. Now we are outside the first.asm file. Now we have written the first.asm file but we need to run this on the terminal to see our output. For that we will use the compiler we just installed which is NASM. So what we need to write is NASM minus F elf64 and then first.asm. Now in this code NASM is the compiler name which means we are telling NASM to compile this file and minus F L64 means this first.asm file will be in x64 architecture because we are using a 64-bit processing system and finally we are telling which file to compile which is our first.asm file. Now as soon as we press enter we can see that there is a first.o file this is an object file and we need to link this object file to get our final executable file which will give us the hello world program. Now to link this first.o file we need to write ld and then first.o. As soon as we press enter we will get our a.out file. This is our executable file. To execute this file we will need to write dot forward slash then a dot out. 
now if you press enter we will get our hello world but as you can see there is a segmentation fault which means something went wrong while the program was running we will talk about this later for now congratulations you have written your first program in assembly language and in the next video i will be discussing the meaning of the code that we just wrote